everybody. Um, it's uh, very good to see everybody here. So my name is Yan from Alibaba. Um, so it's uh, my great pleasure to meet everybody here. Um, make sure I get you to visit. So today, um, I'm just going to give a very quick personal view about uh, Alibaba and the conference and um, and the goals and market we're coming from and what are we trying to do. So it's a very personal view. Okay. So. You can see the background of um, this um, slide. So you can tell me which city is it? Shanghai, exactly. So that's the background of us, and also the background of um, you know, we're going to talk about today. So it's, um, first off, I want to say it's an enormous opportunity. It's a very, very big opportunity. Too early, too late, not good. So time now is perfect timing. So we think we can say in five come in years and uh, you know the, the consumption of the Chinese okay cons consumers will be entirely the market will be bigger than the entire retail market of uh, UK or Germany so it's a big um, place marketplace for people to do to work in and uh, who is a buyer okay who is paying for that so so we have a uh, lot of shoppers and uh, as you can see we have uh, over uh, half a billion shoppers, okay, consumers in China, so they will pay for it. So the rise of the e-commerce in China might be not the person, best person to talk about it, but um, as you can see, it's, um, it drives 42% of the entire consumption of the you know, Chinese um, consumption market. So W11, probably you heard of this already, it's becoming um, Pretty well known, you know, festival in China now. Uh, started from year 2013, and in past three years, been extremely successful. And this year, we can say it's really good. So we later we can take a look, look at it, and um, and uh, yeah, we achieve um, very good. Uh, uh, starting year 2015, okay, then uh, 14, and uh, we have become um, uh, IPO is a public company as well. So I can see Jack Ma, so people know this already. So our mission and um, for our to, to to exist in this world is to make everybody can do the business easy and uh, easy consumption, easy transaction, easy payment, easy shopping, and easy to do the business from the staff up to the very large scale of the business company. So we see us is the gateway to China through us. So we are the gateway, and uh, China is a huge market, enormous market with lots of opportunities. Um, so we want to take you there, okay, to the um, to the next step of the, of the business. So e-commerce is where we're from, okay. But um, uh, from year 1999, we started the e-commerce business. We launched our first uh, e-commerce platform, and uh, up to now, we have uh, a lot more more than just e-commerce to help you to complete your, um, your portfolio and your services and uh, how to land your business into China and also the global market. So on top of that, we have the logistics platform for you to, to deliver. We have the payment okay, for you to for the transaction money. For you to take money, make payments, and uh, easily and very smoothly. And we have the cloud platform for you to build your uh, infrastructure and your services. You can launch your services quickly like that. Just uh, two hours later, maybe you can have your service up running. People can access it. Um, and the marketing, marketing important. People need to know you. And from somewhere far away, but uh, you need to be quickly plugged into the local market. So we have the platform for the for this one, so which is known. Uh, Adimama probably heard of it as well. So um, yeah, we are doing quite a lot of platforms. And um, here, we, here we go. Here is the, the, the whole company, whole portfolio looks like. Um, we, had, we can say sitting in the core of the whole portfolio is, uh, is the brands and also the, sorry, the consumers. Because the consumers, they need to buy things and the sellers, they want to sell. So in order to make this happen, not just locally, Okay, we need to make this happen globally in a very large scale market. So many people need to shop 
and to, to, to deliver people to make the payments, people to take the payments, and, uh, and also along with many other things, taxation and legal services as well. So on top, on top of that, okay, we have um, quite a lot of platforms built up for that purpose. As you can see, you probably heard this or something somewhere already. Timo, Timo is uh, is our B two C platform, okay, and uh, we have Timo Global. That means that the international brands can sell into China, okay. People can just uh, buy straight away from from the website, accessing from in China. And we also have a different versions of Timo for people to different types of the B customer or C customer, B two C, okay, and uh, we have. Um, a lot of things are the Alipay it's, uh, and financials. We will talk about it later today. So it's, uh, it's, uh, it's a big you know, um, you know, financial services as well. And uh, OK, so we can say for this entire portfolio, we have a very important part sitting underneath to enable it, to make this happen. As you can see, we can see the cloud technology. We have a very big you know, the cloud platform. It's a huge investment from the company and it's a really important, critical, vitally critical to the, the entire um, business. And so we have the operating system for the mobile. And, uh, and so we have the big data sitting on top of that to, to make the transaction happen, to make the business, real business happen. So that's the entire portfolio. Okay, seems to be okay. Sudden jump on to you, and uh, so we can take a look at how we get there step by step. So there are several key milestones for the company from the beginning to here. And uh, in year 1999, it's um, two major things happened. Okay, so two major services launched for that purpose is one is Alibaba.com. It's the first B two B global platform. That means that the Chinese business sellers can, can sell to overseas market. And it means also people can buy from China directly through the platform, find the, the seller and uh, sourcing for the okay, buyers. And later, we found a uh, uh, C2C to market, okay, so people to transact. And so uh, uh, dated back to that period of time, it's a very special period uh, stage of the entire China. Okay, so uh, C2C platform also built for that purpose. So it's, um, you can consider it's the, the Chinese version of eBay. So people can sell, everybody can become the entrepreneur, okay, and people can easily to, to transact over that platform. So year 2003, we have some, the C2C platform launched. Year later, we find a very important um, Thing, two things to, to first of all to, to, to handle. One is okay, people people want to buy, and we have people want to sell, and the people need to communicate. People need to talk to each other smoothly, effectively, and easily. So we have uh, so that logo is a um, lovely cotton one, the blue one is uh, is an instant message system. Okay, uh, for people to, to sell us, to people to the buyers, to communicate, to talk, and also second one is the payment. So we got people to want to buy, people want to sell, but people need to know how to make the payments easily. And the different currency, people need to take care of that as well. So we have the Alipay.com, it's Alipay, it's our first financial services launched globally. And three years later, we got the, as you can see, so now we got platform for, for trading, we got buyers, we got sellers, we got people can make payments, can talk. Okay, so in order to make the whole business move forward, we need a very good marketing platform to, to advertise, to, to increase the awareness of the brands, of the sellers. And so, so we have launched the Alimama, so give us an online marketing platform, people can do the advertisement. Um, so it's a, it's very, it's already so 80 years I was at that moment. And two more important things afterwards is one is Timo. Timo is uh, our B2C platform. So, so as you can see, we got C2C, we got B2B, and uh, also we have a B2C. So that means uh, we have a lot of you know, brands, okay, they involved from the so C2C market from Taobao become a branded seller. So they are more than just a consumer, it's more than just an individual seller, they become a SME. So lots of startup companies, okay, they migrated from the, the B Taobao C2C platform onto the B platform, become the B seller. 
And so we launched that for that purpose to complement this uh, trading e-commerce you know, marketplace. Year 2009, it, we have two very big things. One is um, so cloud platform. So cloud platform initially is for the internal usage to support entire business, and also externally is going to be available to the external, you know, the partners and the customers and the people to use. On top of that, but year 2009, back to that year in China, that's a very incredible, you know, very crazy. Crazy minds, okay, to 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 do, and also that year is the tenth anniversary of the entire company. So uh, if you Google um, on the YouTube for the what year, what happened during that year, you are seeing lots of great stuff during that year. So year two thousand nine, tenth year anniversary of the entire group. So okay, so after that year, we enter the new era. So can and we have the AliExpress. AliExpress is the um, is the people probably people using this already on the mobile phone. People can easily to to shop. Okay, global, you know, B two C as well. And uh, Tenial Tenial year two thousand thirteen is for the logistics platform. And as again, we don't do the logistics by ourselves. We do the logistics platform. And uh, year two thousand fourteen. Two big things. One is company be listed, okay, a New York stock exchange becomes a um, um, okay public company, and uh, then we have uh, launched the uh, end financials. Alipay becomes um, the part of end financials. It's um, the second uh, largest you know um, body within the entire group. So last year, okay, we achieved a um, uh, big probably the biggest is the single day festival. So during that day, we achieved a 14.14 uh, billion uh, US dollars transaction. The GMV happened during that day. Okay, so it's a, it's a, it's a marvelous in the shopping festival for, for, uh, for entire China and also global. And, um, and, and, and to probably, and it's in China, it's ninety-one point two billion. So anyone knows the, the the figure for this year? Because we just completed the single stay for this year in November. And okay, here we go. So this year we achieved the seventeen point eight billion U.S. dollars. You know, GMV we are doing that twenty-four hours through the entire portfolio. You have seen. To make this happen, so in order to make this happen, we have the the cross border, very very active trading platform to to enable the sale, enable people to buy, to source, to pay. Okay, and um, four key figures. Um, one is um, the order processing system, so people do take orders, and the order and so up to one hundred seventy five thousand orders per second is at the peak time. That means, but we don't lose any order at all. Second one is the payments. People got place ordered, and they need to make the payment afterwards. The peak time up to 120,000 payments through our pay system. Many orders, okay. Total orders eventually, we achieved 457 million orders. And uh, in total, we have over a billion orders to be delivered through our logistic platform. So it's um, it's a big okay, also big increase since last year. Um, so all about this is more than just uh, Alibaba. It's an ecosystem. Thanks to the ecosystem, we can't do this alone. We don't sell anything. We don't buy anything. We don't really ship anything. So all about platform. So we have a platform to enable this happen. So this is is the power of uh, the ecosystem. Even just a day. So that's another um, example I want to can give you. So you can see from here, lots of people. So what they are doing here? So actually, they are queuing for the, for the train tickets. You want to buy the tickets, you want to, you know, but you couldn't do that in the past, okay, through the online system. They have to do that through the, um, the you know physical one so join the queue and uh, buy the tickets from the station. Um, so it's not it's not 
people can't wait, allow this happen forever. So we need to, to handle this um, issue. Okay. So we launched a okay, um, uh, survey to suppose that government have a fabulous, very famous um, uh, project for that. It's website named 12306.com. Okay. It's, uh, it's the ticking system. Okay. It's the booking. People can purchase tickets, change tickets, modify reservations through that platform. But in order to make that happen, it's uh, it's a very difficult, okay? So we support government, we support the entire, okay, uh, the, you know, the, the organization to make this happen. Three major issues we need, we need to handle. First one is the capacity, because uh, we have lots of, you know, people want to buy tickets. But before that, they will send requests for the tickets for the train information. So there's lots of inquiries coming from from everywhere, from everybody, in completely unplanned way. So it's massive. It seems just like the, the attack, the attack, okay, DDoC, DDoC attack. Okay, second one is security. It has to be very secure. You have lots of buyers. Uh, information and uh, payment information, finance information sitting there. And third one is the um, availability, because we may, must make sure make, must make sure we have the 24/7 unplanned stop cut down our services. It must be there all the time with no compromise at all. So yeah, so that's again this is Alibaba Alibaba Cloud Platform to make this happen briefly. So we have um, yeah. As you can see, during the spring festival travel season, we have uh, lots of 300 million okay, travelers. Okay, during that period of time, people want to move from the north to the south, or the south to the north, so across the entire regions. Um, lots of trends, 3.2 billion, 3 .2 billion journeys. So that's the Alibaba Cloud makes this happen. Okay, again, it's not really just the cloud, it's the whole ecosystem. Okay, thank you, everybody.